Uh, okay. So, yeah. Playing as Benley, we're gonna go do the mission Beauty and the Beast. Which is where we beat up Mugshout as Carmelita. It's time we dealt with Mugshot. We can't risk him taking down the Baron before you in the finals. Not to mention he deserves a little payback for what he did to our aircraft hangar. True, true. Since Mugshot's assault, the Baron has been keeping an eye on him. We can't fight him out in the open for risk of getting disqualified. Thankfully, Wouldn't want Mr. that. Mr. Fox is out in the field looking for us. I hear you. We'll set them against each other. Mugshot is an international criminal, after all. Carmelita won't be able to resist. My only concern is for Inspector Fox's safety. Oh, don't worry about her. <sighs> She's more than a match for a meathead like <sighs> Mugshot. Sorry, guys. I'm okay, real tired right I'll now. I'll pick a fight with Mugshot and bait him into beating in the town square for our rumble. You do that. I'll get Carmelita's attention and lead her back here to the same place. Agreed. I've got to hand it to you, Benley. This is a really underhanded plan. Why, thank you. I don't I think so. I pretty good about it. <sighs> so yeah, we dress up as a pilot. Even though it's kind of hard to fly a plane when you don't have your legs to use. Can't use the, uh, can't steer the front tire, the nose wheel, you can't <coughs> rotate the rudder. It's helpful to have those things. I'll beat it, twerp. The Black Baron's been giving me the grill since that event in your hangar. Perhaps he should. I'd like to take out some frustration by engaging in a physical battle with me outside of the town square. No way! I'm being watched here. That, and it wouldn't feel right pounding a four-eyed runt in a wheelchair. Well, at least he has some sympathy for Bentley, sort of. Okay, you have to say two different things before you can actually say the thing that'll let you pass. So, I don't care which one you use as long as you say something. I find a nice tang to my breath helps maintain my poisonal space. Yeah. Do you even know what I'm saying to <sighs> you? Or are you too Shit. stupid to understand I'm real the tired right now. It's like through your ear holes. 11 o'clock or something? What? What's an ear hole? Talk sense, why don't you? Your mother okay, what you want to say is you have to, you're going to want to insult his mother. Gentlemen callers than the operator. Nobody talks that way about See? my mother. Nobody! Now he'll get all mad and stuff and he'll walk outside and get owned by me or Carmelita who's being played by me. So in theory I'm basically playing this entire game. Okay Sly, Bugshot is on his way outside. Go find Inspector Fox and lead her back to the town square. Alright, so go over to the uh aircraft hangers and stuff and that's where you'll find Carmelia. If you forget there is a marker on her so don't be asking me well where is she? You have a marker you should be able to know how to use it if you've done the, ha the uh, hazard room and uh, you sh you have to know. I should remind you. And here she is. And I'm gonna steal from her. Because I can. And because she has money. She doesn't usually have money on her. Hey, Inspector Fox. Still looking for a date to the prom? Quit running and I'll spin the first log. Oh. Oh, jeez. Oh, she's getting better at her aim. Keep running. Whoa, that was close. I juked that out like it was in the Matrix or something. I love that movie. Especially the first one. Blasted, Sly. Why run? I've played Why the game I before. Like a real man? I never got past that mansion with all the crazy rooms that were upside down and stuff. It was annoying. With me, that little punk is gonna eat dice. Hey! 
you're that cop hag that busted me back in Mesa City. Mugshot. Yep. Alias Two Gun Tony, also known as Meathead Mugshot. Seven <laughs> foot three inches, hey, that's the truth. 24 pounds, wanted in seven countries with 13 outstanding warrants for your arrest. And yes, I'm that cop hag that put you away back in Mesa. Well, wise guy, lady. Feel like going to think about it. Uh, it's my oh yeah, you're a lady. Not a guy. That, and I enjoy making tough guys cry like the stupid babies they really are. I ain't no stupid baby. You're about to be after I mess you up with my pistol. You know, if he'll shoot at you, you just have to keep jumping. And if you get hit, it's not really that much. There's, it's not that much damage done to you. You will feel you will feel feel your taser a lot more than you'll feel his bullets. Alright, I want to get away from that guy before he shoots me out or something. Uh, yeah. Not you. I'm sorry. I didn't know they was yours. Looking this idiot. Well, I don't know what he was flashing back to, but I'm pretty sure he did something that his mother wasn't very happy about. Okay. All right, so we're 19% done. We only get to 50%. What I'm doing that is because I'm not going back and doing all the challenges and stuff. Just doing the jobs. Just doing the playthrough of it. Next is Giant Wolf Massacre. This guy's got some money, so I want to rob him. Because he is worth robbing. And I'm juking out those spotlights. Whoa. Close. Come on, get it, get it. It was worth it! Ow. I run. Damn it, I got hit twice. That was bull. Alright, run to the mission. Run to the mission. <laughs> 